mean, that's true. I mean, unless you're, like, literally hacking their bodies apart. Watery Pass North. Right. This dungeon is bigger than... Oh, Ryan, look! You can see down more... Oh, that's my... That's super cool. Wow. Parallax scrolling is yeah. what that is called, and that is super dope. That is so cool. They had that it's in it's Sonic the Hedgehog as well. Oh, nice. To have parallax they, scrolling backgrounds. They really... I, I think the thing is, like, 6 is even more impressive looking than this one. Really? Yeah, I oh. think so. I feel like and this is do we really know anything gen. about 5? Um, I've played a good portion of 5 before. Mm. I like that one a lot, too. That one's all job system all the time. Mm. Yeah. You get this job system redux. I would like an elaboration on the job system. Although, even though we just came off of it, I'm kind of glad that we're going to get this sort of narrative mm -hmm. just straight leveling the, up. Break, the thing is, but... 5 has a good story, too. Mm. I, I feel like. Um, it's a little bit... I guess that's a little bit dialed back, but it has it's it's different than three because the characters don't uh they have they have personalities, you okay. know what I mean? They're built in. So even though they're changing their jobs all the time, it doesn't affect who they right. Are, I think which is also yeah. Once again, Bravely Default does that. Yeah, that's yeah exactly. That's it really just changes good what they outfit they're wearing, but not who they are. Mm-hmm. Exactly. And Cave I toads and mad toads. Ooh, what do you think they're mad about? Ugh, who is it? Job market. Right? Isn't that depressing? Mad Toads know, know... Wow. Mad Toads know Mad all toads about it. Mad Toads know all about it's it. It's like I'm a living human being. Are you? What do you think, right? Mm. Debatable? Definitely debatable. Mm, what's debatable about it? Whether you're a being or not. What, you're definitely what, living. You're definitely human. What would you what What would you debate about my being precisely? <laughs> oh, backed you into a corner there, my friend. I couldn't evade your logical trickery. <laughs> my, my incisive, decisive, deductive, inductive line of questioning. Yeah. My regular Sherlock Holmes. I'm a regular firebrand. That's what I am. A heat, heat spewing, gas guzzling. Highway destroying machine, fuel injected, over the stepped out over the line, fourth gear. Speaking oh. of being fuel injected, fifteen. Horsepower. Get that car. What? Get some horsepowers in there. What? Oh, oh in the 15. car. Yeah. I'm mad about no girls. Oh. I see. Yeah. Come on, Final Fantasy. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> hey, no, not you. You fight. Oh, she needs bullets. She needs bullets for her her gun that she has. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Oh, I got toted. He toted the shit out of you, but he can still cast spells. Don't worry about Maybe it. Maybe he can still use his ice. Magic? I mean, I'm he, guessing he, he can't cast ice spells ring. because he can't speak English anymore or Japanese, as the case may be. Oh, this toad is turning you into a, a toad. Also, you're a blue toad. They are right? different colored toads. Oh, he, look at Televibrate. I hope. Uh, cures this. I hope so too. Otherwise, we're <laughs> fucked. Do, do, you should check your. Oh my god! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Holy shit! You're actually a toad! That's hilarious. Oh my lord! Oh good. It turns you back into a sage. Okay, quick break. Alright. Alright, here we are! Here we are. Back in FIFA 2. That's not really what this is. Soccer World Champ. Tella for Manchester United. Sorry. Had a belch. Alright. Oh, darkness we got the blade. Darkness Blade, Ryan. Sick. Some previous Dark Knight just dropped their yeah, sword down here. dumped it. 17 versus 27. Whoa! You can't duel Sorry. with swords. No, I believe that is the unique province of the ninja. Ooh. Yeah. We can go out from here. The monster is in the cave beyond there. We should camp to regain our strength out there. Okay. They're being very forgiving with yeah. being out and about and saving. Totally. I guess I've gotten a thousand tents, so I might as well use one. And by a thousand, I mean eight. Yeah, you have a ton of tents. Ooh. Right, you know what they say after once you once you've used a tent, right? It's it's past. Those are past tense. <laughs> this has been I played 25 years of Final Fantasy. See you again, never. Bye. <laughs>
My cousin divorced me. What a fuck. Cousin divorced <laughs> It's down here! Oh, shit. Oh, God. Uh, so what do you want us to do? <laughs> I'm confused. Yeah, this is your intention. Alright. Okay. We're here now. Wait, why did we do this? I really don't know. Precisely? Alligators. Oh! This case full of gators. <laughs> There's a gator! Man, these guys are tough. They're beating us up. No. Uh, uh. Would you like to hear Claire's book recommendation? Uh, yes. Oh, are they hurting you real bad? They're strong. Ooh, they're hurting Tala real bad. I finished reading Stephen King's Doctor Sleep. How was that? Last week. It was really good, actually. I feel like I was a little iffy as it was proceeding. Um, I feel like it's very easy to look at the, the villains in that book and kind of be a little skeptical. Mm -hmm. um, they're essentially a group of... They're, they're kind of like described as like average middle-aged or to, to getting older people who like drive around in RVs. They're like... Are, and and their leader is Rose the Hat, who wears a top hat. Okay. But they're psychic child torturing vampires. Oh, that's not good. They shouldn't nope. do that. No. Um so so that's bad. But it's really cool. If you've read The Shining, um it it's it's the sequel. Mm hmm So it, it, it picks up um with Danny from the original, the kid. Right. Uh, I don't know. That part of it is really, really cool to me. And it's, I don't know, it's kind of also unique. I feel like there aren't a lot of authors who get to do, write a book 40-some years ago, and they get to revisit it in a sequel. Yeah. You know what I mean? And I think that part was really neat. It, it, and it, it's really interesting to see how he's changed kind of as an author in terms of what he's concerned about, how some things really haven't changed. But there's also just, it's like... The Shining was written by, like, young alcoholic Steve, Stephen King mm -hmm. when he was, like, in his 20s. And then this one was written by, like, 60-year-old King. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like, who's now... I don't know. And he's still just good at telling the story. I have, like, a lot of... I have a lot of Stephen King stuff. Uh, but it was good. Well, go ahead. Yeah. Good characters. That's... I think that's the, that's the part. That, that always... That elevates it for me. Yeah, I mean... If there aren't good, believable, interesting, multifaceted characters, it becomes hard to enjoy. Well, you know there's something special. It's like that thing, you know, like when you when you leave a game, or you leave, stop reading a book, when you realize you're not going to be around those characters anymore. You know what I mean? That yeah. particular sadness, like there should be a specific word for that feeling. Probably is in German. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> but, I mean, that's exactly what this game, or this, what that book did. Surprise. I honestly feel like, to be perfectly honest, that's what this game did to me too as a kid. Hmm. It was the only time in the history of my life that I felt compelled to keep to want to tell the story of the characters afterwards. I'm not like I a fan feel like of that's why or... there are two thirteen sequels is because the characters are so fucking good. You, you think? Yeah. I mean, I am of the opinion that those characters are good, even though there are a couple that are annoying. They're good. I like lightning. I also like lightning. Lightning's great. Uh, Saz is great. Snow is doofy, but fine. Who's Saz? Saz is the black guy. Oh, bird guy. Who yeah. has the child. Yeah, And, yeah, like, yeah. his whole story is, like, Sorry, I kind the of forgot biggest bummer. Of main characters there. And Snow is the bandana guy? Snow is the bandana guy. Gotcha. Um, oh, you're just getting... Up. Darkness home. <laughs> that's all right. If you want to give us sick darkness gear, that's cool. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Oh, I haven't looked. Has it, does his sword look different now? I missed oh, it. Oh, I didn't really look either. No, it just all Stop talking about right now. It was like a blue thing before. Yeah, it was like a like blue blue blade. A little blue needle. Absolutely. We'll have the opportunity to see it right oh, yeah. here. Jellies! It's some squid billy. Oh, that is, that is what I always remembered. Them in this game, the pudding people, and now the I pudding people. now I see that they're from. Oh, I hate them as much as I did before. They're the best. They're they look a little less in bad this. in this one. I think. I think they're grosser. I mean, they're grosser, but they they look less like cartoon squid billies to me, which makes me. Oh, I think you just healed them. No, did you? They look green to me, but what do I know? No, it's damaged. Okay. Mmm, but ice is clearly not the thing. Because the rocks. 
just lightning the thing? Maybe. You're in a watery environment. It didn't really help, did it? Well, you got him. Yeah, he got there eventually. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's fire. Maybe I'll try fire next time. What were they called? Jellies? Jellies? <laughs> what element would you use on a jelly? <laughs> <laughs> to destroy a jelly, would you set it on fire? Would you freeze the jelly? Or would you send an electric current through the jelly? <laughs> Mystery for our time. <laughs> or would you shake the earth beneath the jelly? <laughs> that one. That one. Because it vibrate it at the same frequency as its own oscillation and yeah. turn it into a complete puddle. Exactly. You got this down. Yeah. That guy, that alligator, that guy, that guy looks really hungry <laughs> over there. But he doesn't seem to have a ton of teeth on the bottom half. No, yeah, he's mostly top teeth. Do alligators munch? Do, like, do they chew or do they swallow? I prey. think they choose some. Or is it like a killing device? Oh, I don't really know. Actually. You know what I mean? Yeah. Cecil's sword is now yellow. Oh, thank you. I keep missing it. That's really cool. I like that darkness in this game. The dark... Ah, oh, so cool. Shadow Blade's blue. Darkness Blade is yellow. Mm-hmm. It doesn't really light up. <laughs> what? The Darkness oh. Blade is bright yellow. I like it. Looks like a, like a kind of rusty old magic rune sword kind of thing. Mm, mm -hmm. Yellowy. Yellowing. Yellowy yellowing. Darkness armor. Are you just stocked up right now? Yeah, I'm totally fine with all of this. All that's happening right here. It's really cool. Boom. Nice. Stronger than ever. Um, I don't think there's any reason to go down the ramp. I also don't think I can. So oh, there's your monster. There they are. Mm -hmm. All right, more jellies. What about the peanuts, huh? The what? Peanut butter. Oh. Uh, you say peeps? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what they call her on uh, Adventure Times. Peeps. Pe Wait, what's her name? What's the princess? Princess Bubblegum? Oh yeah, that has nothing to do with peanut butter. I don't know why I assumed that it did. By the way, it is definitely fire. Maybe oh yeah, fire. you kind of, you kind of, figured kind of quick killed them there. Yeah. Well, you just like, do you like random battles with jellies and mad toads? I'm not crazy about them. Are these ones that turn you into toads, or they just get y'all funky? I think they do turn us into toads if we're not careful. That's why you don't want to lick them. You yes. know how when in reality you lick anything, you turn into it. Yeah. Hmm. That's why most of human population is popsicles. <laughs> and some people are just weird, weird thing. Hey, thank you. Oh, that was perfect. They turned me back into human right oh, before that's he attacked. Awesome. That, was a, that was a very nice Ollie Hoop moment. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. You can't hit a you couldn't hit the broad side of a frog. <laughs> toad. Mm -hmm. Broad side of a toad. I feel like every side of the toad is the broad side. Well, I mean, like, it's all smushed down, so that side, you know, its sides aren't, you know what I'm saying. Mm. Mm -hmm. Alright. Heal up. Yeah. And get ready. For a mystical magical battle. It's happening. Should I? Uh, I'll just go ahead. Might as well. Feels like a waste. Alright, here goes! He's coming! Whoa. Whoa, those are the tentacles. Octomam! Octomam? Octomam? Whoa, Whoa, yeah, I remember this guy. He's a goofy fucking grin. Oh, look <laughs> at that. He has like the hat of a pen think this. I gotta oh. assume lightning does it. Mm -hmm. I also think you have to kill his uh, tentacles, though. Oh, unless it's, he doesn't have multi-target? He doesn't have multi-target. Oh, I think you just do damage to him and he'll kill his tentacles. That sounds right. Yep. Yeah, there it was. Shave some off. Ooh, he has he has a deliriously wow, evil 200. visage. Yeah, <laughs> he's crazy. Yeah. Looking. What color are his eyes? Like green? Oh, I should summon her. Yeah. No, look. It makes. See if she does the. Uh, yeah, I got to I got to see. I'm, I'm, I swear to God, that's what she used to do. But I totally could have made that up as a kid. <laughs> I think it's a very literal interpretation of color. I thought it was kind of like a cute... Like, well, like how dark is a... Oh, no. I totally fucked, 
fucked it up. I mean, she does put one arm up, so I can kind of see where I you're coming from. God, I thought that was a cell phone, but... Nice. This is thrilling. It is very thrilling. And this octopus is just demented. Yeah, look at him. He, you're, you're tearing him apart, and he doesn't really seem to care. Yeah. Killer. That'd be dead. But you have life cells even. That's true. You got this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I Look, got he only this. has three tenths left. Three tenths. You have more tenths than he does. That's true. Hey! You're right. Look at the cool spots on his head. Oh, yeah, I mean, the shapes. visual design here is awesome. He's all it's orange so and purple cool. and green. Like, just all kinds of colors. You're totally messing him up, though. Good job! Good job! <laughs> He's slowing down! I feel like... Are we getting cocky here? Oh, well, maybe. I hope not. I don't know. Maybe it's just a lot easier than the other games we've been playing. Yeah, I know. Because be. we're playing easy type. Easy type? I don't give a fuck about that. Nah. Play it on easy. Who cares? It's about seeing the game. We'll have plenty of hard games ahead of us, too. And I'm pretty sure this game is not without its difficult moments, even yeah. in its current iteration. And there are definitely games that we're gonna... Because I, I, I'm the boss. We're gonna do some post-game shit that's gonna be really fucking oh, hard. Oh, yeah, yeah. We so. totally should, though. Part of me kind of wants to do it for Final Fantasy VII, because I've never seen that content. I've never seen it either, so if it's... Like, I've never seen Knights of the Round, which is like... Oh, yeah, we beat him. Got him. Woohoo! I mean, I feel good like job, everyone! Knights of the Round is, like, in that game, the way people beat a lot of it. Yeah, it's yeah, you like... need this spell. But, like, I, I can never get a gold chocobo as a kid. Hmm. It was rough. Now we can go to Damstian from behind this waterfall. It leads to the exit. And they need to put in a road. They do. Well, All now right. now we've opened the, the paths for commerce, Ryan. Yeah, we have. Sweet. Onward. Bringing capitalism to the West. Ooh, look at this. Whoa! Oh, I was not expecting that to happen. I wasn't either. No! Ah! <laughs> oh, Jesus. Jesus Christ, Everywhere I didn't we remember go. that. What? Everywhere we go, it's just... just oh, oh my god. god. This is this is some Final Fantasy II stuff right now. Yeah, for real. Oh, these people are just... Those are just corpses. Just death and destruction. Those are... They took the crystal. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible bombardments from the airships. Oh, man. This is wild and rough. Oh, they and they took the place. all the treasure? How, I don't even so know how they did that. <laughs> yeah, they took everything. There was a pot of recovery above. <laughs> Pot of recovery. Pot o recovery. Think a quick hitter. <gasps> that is Anna! Aha! Anna! Who's this fabulous person? <laughs> You're the bard? You did this to her! Huh? He needs the, the most fruitiest. Oh shit! This is Brian. You swindler! Uh, please, listen. <laughs> you <laughs> bony bard! <laughs> please! <laughs> classic, classic. Oh, I actually hit him that time. Shut up! Listen! They both just had very high pitch voice. He needs, like, the most spoiled, rotten, rich boys. Shut your mouth! I... I... I don't really know what a spoiled, rotten, rich boys is. <laughs> Please, stop! He sounds like an aristocrat. Hmm. Okay. Are you alright? You do, Amos. Okay. I'll do, I'll do, Brad. Or Bart. Father, Edward is the Prince of Damsian. He was disguised as a bard when he came to see me in Kaipo. 
Forgive me, father, for running away, but I love Edward. We thought of asking for your consent, but when we were about to leave... I can't be both of these. Uh, I'll be, I can do Edward if you want. <laughs> I'd have three. Yeah, you do Edward. Golbez attacked us with Baron's red wings. Who is that man? I don't know. But why? He took our crystal of fire, and Anna shielded me from the arrows. <laughs> the arrows. <laughs> arrows. <laughs> you loved him that much? Father, forgive me. I love Edward. Anna. Anna! Anna! <laughs> Damn. Who is Gobez? That was always my question. When we were young. I heard that he's gathering crystals using Baron's red wings. <laughs> Stop crying. Your tears won't bring back Anna. Wait for me, Golbez. I'm coming to avenge my daughter. Tell's kind of a badass. You can't go alone. Damn. I don't need any help. This is my own affair. To the left. Uh, Anna... Whoa. Cry, baby. You are a man. You are a grown-up. You're not the only one who has lost loved ones. Wow. Rydia. You may be right. I'm just a coward. But I don't care. I'm staying here with Anna. so violent. You're not the only one who is sad, Edward. Besides, Anna won't be happy if you do that. We really need your help. Please, come with us. My help? I am Cecil. I'm looking for the Sand Ruby to help my friend, who is ill in Kaipo. And I need your help. I help you? Yes, you. You. She seems to be an important person. You shouldn't lose your loved one. The sand ruby is made from the ant lion when it lays its eggs in the cave. Gross. The cave's in the east, but we must go across shallows to get there. There is the hovercraft and Damsian we can use. We can also go to Kaipo through the shallows. The hovercraft survived that enormous bombing? Is underground, maybe? Mm. Let's hurry. Prince Edward joined us a bard! Yeah. And, and you got to see Spoonie Bard! A decidedly Spoonie Bard. Mm-hmm. And he just lost the love of his life. Goodbye, Anna. Just cast life on her. She'll be fine. Oh, oh. not if her body disappears. Yeah, that's true. No, she fades out of existence. That is so sad. It is pretty brutal. I guess it was underground, just like every airship. Or Everyone's kind of hurting right now. Whoa! Yeah. This thing is cool as shit. It really is. There he is. He's boohooing in the portrait, even. He's very angsty. So you have a ruby ring, and you have a dreamer? Yeah. He has bard song. Hmm. This doesn't count as magic, I guess. I think he has bard song. It must be like a move in battle or something. I think so. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and those are the shallows, those little rocks. I figured. Hang on, I just want to appear. First vehicle, too. Woo. First vehicle in the game. Ooh. Ooh, that's the Antlion Cave, I believe. Oh, really? I think, I think so. Aren't we supposed to go back to, like, Kaipo or something? Wait, why? 
Without the sand ruby? What's the thing? Oh, I guess not. What is this then? I don't know. Go in there. Mm, I don't think. Oh, you can't go in there anyway. Okay. I don't think. That's for later. Yeah. Artificial barrier. I'd rather there. not get destroyed. Yeah, yeah. By random stuff. You could totally. Yeah. I could totally save the game. Save your game, Ra. You should totally use a tent too, so you can get some MP back. Yeah. Nobody is your only spell woman. <laughs> 